I've got a couple other videos out there uh, on the iPhone 3G. Um, this one right here, I'm going to show you a couple things about it. Um, some nice applications for it. Um, basically the pluses and minuses, the jailbreak in your phone, if it's really worth it or not. Um, that. So let's start off. It's my iPhone 3G. You can see. Um, first thing I'll show you about it. Turn mine on. There's my load up screen. Load up. I changed that using uh, a winter board application. My uh, winter board application is real nice. Uh, you can download that after you. Jailbreak your phone. And let's do the Cydia application. Second, okay, there we are. And as you see, my iPhone is definitely customized. Um, keep it lit up as you see. Carrier logo here. I changed. I've got a globe for the uh, my 3G signal, green signal bars. Um, I'm going to my notepad for the second. As you can see, my notepad. Nice background on my notepad. Um, definitely like that. As you can see here, I've got five docks, um, five icons in my dock. Um, all of my pictures are great. Definitely changed. Um, this is the winter board application. Let you change all your things, batteries, wallpapers, um, header bars, everything. Definitely an awesome, awesome thing to have. Um, okay, over here, must download Snapature. Definitely have to have Snapature. Um, regular iPhone camera. It just has uh, standard photo taking. This one, if you open it up, you can zoom up to three times zoom. Um, down here, this is a photo burst button. Takes three shot bursts. Um, changes the colors. Um, time mode. A lot of different things. Real cool camera to have on the iPhone. Definitely better than a regular iPhone camera. Um, Sidequarter. Another application. Definitely a plus to have on the iPhone. Gives you uh, video recording so you can make videos. Definitely a plus. Um, one of the applications that uh, everybody is interested in. It's this little guy here, right? Swirly MMS. Everybody wants to send MMS messages. Here's my inbox and my swirly. Show you that I do have it working. Got pictures, people sent to me. Here's my friend, Miss Rob. Um, I'm going to send one right now, show you that it does work. Send a brand new message. I'm going to send it to somebody I don't care who you see their phone number is. It doesn't matter. They can't get messages anyways. I'm just going to send it so you see that it goes out. I'm going to send my daughter's picture real fast. Okay, everything's set up. Subject of it, we're going to put an 
last method. So you can see that nothing happened. And we'll send that. No error messages. Not. Nothing in my outbox, so you know. Nice and clear. Um, here's my settings. See that? Nothing special. No P, APM, no username. Uh, image size can be whatever. User agent can be whatever kind of phone you like. Um, definitely. Uh, negative feature to the Swirly application is this. Voicemail unavailable. Um, for those of you that like a visual voice, uh, once you get the Squirrely application running on your phone, I learned that you lose the visual voice because it's only a feature available for iPhone. And when you get the iPhone plan taken off your iPhone, you can't have visual voice anymore. Um, I haven't got voicemail messages in over a week now, uh, my phone rings 15 times and then just goes to uh, operators stating the caller is not available. Uh, please try your call again later. Um, again, changing the settings on my phone to allow Squirrely to work, shut off the visual voice. So if you want that, you might not want Squirrely. Uh, hope that helps you out. Bye.